Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, and we are back from the Monroeville Exchange. And I didn't bother recording on the outside or the inside, so this is going to be a quick trip there and back, because I only had like 100 bucks worth of figures to buy. We got a bag full of toys. I'm going to dump this out, but we got some random stuff for my collection. I got a Bioshock. Two for my PlayStation 3. I will be playing that for sure. And watching these Pokemon movies for my collection. I do not have these, and now I do. Definitely gonna start watching those for sure. So that was all under a hundred bucks. Show ya for the first time a receipt showing you how much I spent. But yeah, that's how much I spent in total. Total was $99.51, so I was way under budget when it came to toys today and movies and games. So let's get down to doing a little show and tell show off. So we got Charles Xavier from the X-Men. Got some brand new figures. This ain't exactly brand new, but it's new to me because I've never opened a brand new Rise of Cobra figure. And this is Cover Girl from G.I. Joe. Rise of Cobra. We got the uh, Ranger Slayer Pink Ranger from Mighty Morphin Range Power Rangers. Why not? A lot of figures to show off. We got a McFarlane Harry Potter. Definitely going to review this by itself. Because it comes with a stand that it's going to review by itself for sure. Got some random toys as well. We got this figure I think is from Aliens. Yeah, she's probably from Aliens. Look at that gear. She is looks like she's ready for battle. Speaking of Aliens, we do got a Predator... The armored mega mega cyborg predator. I saw Bert find one of these, and now I found one. And they just decided to tip over. Sorry about that. We got some of these galactic heroes. They were only two bucks each, so I got quite a few of them. Got an army of galactic heroes for my Star Wars collection. We got several of those. I'm gonna probably have to dump the bag and just show you off everything in the bag. But this is in my local place, the Monroeville Exchange. Find some of these great figures. We got the Decepticon Toaster from Revenge of the Fallen, man. I did not own this guy. And I've seen so many people review him. He's a toaster Decepticon. He, he terrify my dogs. That's how scary he looks. <laughs> That's how scary this guy looks compared to anything else. We got Wolverine. Another version of Wolverine on this toy haul. Count Dooku. ATST driver, Imperial Engineer. Clone Trooper. Never go long with two clone troopers. Ponda Baba. I got him, and this is a figure from Galactic Heroes. He's that guy that Luke cut his arm off of him. Or was it Obi-Wan? I think it was Obi-Wan that chopped his arm off. <laughs> Speaking of Luke, here is young Luke Skywalker from Galactic Heroes. We did get some Masters of the Universe figures. We got Beast Man and Stratos. They will be reviewed with the random little figures. Probably by themselves as random figures. Next, we got some Pokemon. I forget this guy's name, but if you know, leave me a comment. I would appreciate it. Because I love some vintage Pokemon toys from my childhood. We got this girl who was always next to Finn in Star Wars Resistance. Why not? She's a cutie. Why not? 
got young Obi-Wan Kenobi. Quite a few galactic heroes here. We're getting through the Transformers and the Pokemon. Next, we got Sandshrew and the evolved form of Psyduck, Golduck, I think it is. And this Pokemon. If you know his name, then leave me a comment because I don't know who this guy is. I don't know a lot of the Pokemon, except for certain ones. I remember their names. We got an animated fast food toy, Ratchet, which we will be reviewing on this channel. So he'll probably be this week's review for an Autobot review. So yeah. Got a Transformers Prime Beast Hunters. Bumblebee. We got like two versions of them here. Here's another one. Why not? Transformers. Beast Wars, McDonald's toy, Tarantulas, I think this is supposed to be. Swimmers Prime RC, which I do like RC. She is the uh, cute Autobot motorcycle girl. That's why I have two of her now, huh? I think her leg is a little bit on wrong. I might have to fix her legs a bit later. But yeah, we got her. We got another Transformers Prime Legends Viacon. So I'm building up a Viacon army. Why not? Dare I say why not? I'll review another one of those and compare it to my original, too. We got a Galactic Heroes, or whatever this line this guy comes from. It's Sunstreaker. Non-transforming figure of Sunstreaker. Why not? We got R&D Windblade in Legends form. So I got another Windblade for the collection. Why not? And who doesn't remember Butt Shots? And it's Shockwave. So this was one I had to grab because I like Shockwave. So yay for my very first Butt Shot. <laughs> and the last figure we got is the Shredder from TMNT. I might be on the hunt for the future when I go to the exchange for more. TMNT, Turtles, and so forth. And this is Eddie Hill, the entire toy haul from the Monroeville Exchange. If you like this video, please make sure to like, please make sure to comment, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. And this is Eddie Hill, moving on, and rock on and rock out, YouTube land.